Even with this demoralizing display, the speaker chooses ignorance. He brushes off any suggestion the sorceress Mateus gushed us. Huh. That's a long and sordid tale. Suffice to say, Medea hasn't been seen here in decades. But Corinth pays regular tribute to the sorceress. Of course, the speaker insists the tribute was sent and that the druids invited this disaster. <sighs> By the way, the situation is dire and growing worse. I prefer not to recruit a newcomer for such a dangerous enterprise. But the truth is, if we don't salvage what we can from the farms, starvation will bring more lost. But please, before you do anything else, check in at the inn. Take what time you need, and then I'll be calling a meeting in the tavern. If you're inclined. Thank you. Oh. Nice to speak with someone not miserable or insane. Uh, there's another newcomer, a rather feisty young woman. You'll likely see her at the inn. Welcome to the sad breeze. May a gentle wind always guide you home. You wish to check in? Now, this is a pleasant surprise. Two new customers in one day. Have you been hiding? I was afraid I'd have to go back to the beach and search for you. Not that I wanted to stay here, mind you. This hamlet's ready for a bloody wake. Problems? I've raided tombs more lively than this place. I don't plan on hanging around here long. Not when the winds are shifting the way they are. It's bad business. 